Motor locations and parameter setting. 调节参数，所有的数字越大，就往里走；数字越小，往外走。So, big number means the clip will go inside. The small number means the clip will go outside. 所有的这个标识。都是要在绿色的状态下才可以控制电机，如果是黑色状态下它是没有通电的，电机没通电。啊、uh, ，So we have to make sure all this part is the green with the green color. This means the servo motor is connecting with the PLC. If it's not with the green color, that means the servo motor. Cannot control by this screen. This screen, which is this, is controlling the voltage of the servo motor. So this servo motor is control this motor, and this motor is mainly to control the the clip up and down. That means this. Servo motor is control these two small servo motors. 我们按正方向、反方向，这和就这这边都会变动，这是当前位置。啊，比如说我要焊接位置的话，我这个位置调到，比如我我这时候焊接位置，我把这个参数设置到这里，它就是就是我们所需要的位置。So, uh, this is this this is called the position position, the position position. So this this number is the current position, and if you want to adjust, you can press this these two buttons. And after you think, after you think the position is good, then you have to input this number into this. Area. So each each number of this line is showed the location, the current location. And if you want to adjust, you can press pr adjust this. Then if you think the position is okay, then you put this number into this area. This is a very long distance transmitter device. 然后它这个长度现在是九十，也就是对应的在现在这个送出来的鼻梁长度是九十。So this servo motor is mainly to control the length of the nose pin. This number ninety means ninety millimeters, which is indicated here is ninety millimeters. So it's mainly to is control this motor, and uh, this motor is mainly to push, so it's no need to adjust. Mass folding device instruction. This is the front. The front is to turn. The front is to turn this end point. For this end point, it is half a second. The front is to turn up and down. Then this one is to turn the highest point. 往往往，它高低作用就是口罩下边要切到这个线，大概留一毫米。哦、oh. 嗯。So this is the folding part. You can adjust the folding part by this handrail, and to make sure the middle line was strictly in the same alignment with the point. So, okay. so if you 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 turn at this, you are the the fabric will go there. Then you if you turn this come this location, the fabric will come inside. And uh, this part is mainly to adjust. It's mainly to adjust this part.
part. To make sure we will have one millimeter extra, we can see here. We can see this much. It have we got too much, so need to uh, adjust. Edge cutting adjustment. 就是调这个切边的左右左右移动，一往往这边去。比如说现在这个口罩它是没有没有这个边摔的，那我就往里拧，这样拧。然后这个边如果太多了，再往外拧。大概我们这最好的位置是留一毫米。So for this part, it's many to adjust. 这里啊，这个啊 ，is many to adjust this part. We have to make sure we have one millimeter extra. If this printer printing is too out, you can adjust this. 可以了。嗯。Edge sealing servo motor parameter setting. 中间的。电机的进去的深度，方边的深度等于是、啊、这个印花的深度。对，印花的深度。如果它原点位置是不用调，然后要调的就是只是进去的深度而已。啊。So, uh, in the page two and this location, this is many to control the edge spinning the motors, and this is many, and this motor. Function is many to adjust the printing line thickness. So the bigger the number is, the more thick, the more thicker of this printing is. Access edge cutting adjustment. 一步。这是一第一页。对，第一页。一步。So uh, we have to make sure the cutting cut the mass shape. So we have to adjust this. It's made this button is make sure the fabric will move forward. And it's on the page one. Use this point to hit it. Oh, use this point to hit. Hit this point. Oh. This point. Oh. This point. Oh. This point. Oh. 哦，如果差不多，还是差不多一到他，这个就算到手了，一到他位置就把刀往里面。扭，扭，如果后面有一点点不一样就微调，有一点点不一样就微调这里吗？就微调这里啊？对。哦，微调这里就行了。对。So, uh, so we have to, uh, make make sure this part wall almost. Alignment with this shape, the line shape, and after we make sure it's on the line, it's on the alignment. We have to tight lock the handrail. If there has a little a little problem with the alignment, you can. Adjust this handrail. Pearl loop installation showing. So this button is many. Bang and shot. Control this clip. And this button. Bang and shot. It's many to control that clip. Okay. Oh, this one. 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 So this is many to control the yellow plate. Okay. Oh, this is not the right one. One is to one is to control two, right? Yes. So, so a one button can control two plates. So this button is many to control two plates. You can see. Okay. 这一个是剪刀。嗯。So this is many to control the cutter of this side. 
Ah, so you go to home and another Servo motors location is managed to control. Okay, it's okay. It's managed to control these leaders. Okay. So this is managed to control this side of orthostatic, and this button is managed to control that two welding parts at parts. You can hear the sound. If if it has this sound, means it's connected. Ah, uh, this one from is to hold the part. Ah, so this orthostatic is managed to control this mass mood. This one is to hold the part. Ah, so this. But this button is managed to control the edge feeling of the toilet. So this button is managed to control the nose pin part, this part. Hello. Today we are going to do a transformer. Yes. Yes. This is the switch. So. This is the power switch for the whole set of the machine. 蜂鸣器是用来干什么？啊、uh, ，This is the buzzer. That means if the machine has problem, it will alarm. 然后这个是停止。This is the stop. 这个启动。This is to start. 急停。And this is the emergency stop. 那急停和停止有什么区别？停止是按的慢慢停，急停是下下去的时候立即停止。啊、uh, ，so this stop button is the machine will stop slowly, but if you press the emergency stop, the machine will stop suddenly. This side has a function, function unit. 功能液就是屏蔽跟启用一些，我们启用一些报警装置啊。So here has some alarm functions you have to switch on. 啊，这个是过掉报警，启用的话是绿色。So if you want to, if you want to have the short of fabric automatically stop, you will, you have to turn on this. 下一个，这个是耳戴层报警，这一根。没有耳戴层，它会停机吗？没有耳戴层，它会停机。啊、uh, ，So this is a ear loop alarm. 这个是。If you open this button, when it when the ear loop run out, you will automatically stop. 这个是鼻梁报警，鼻梁缺掉要报警。啊、uh,。如果你这上面没鼻梁，没感应到鼻梁，就会报警。So this is the nosing alarm. If if the Other sensor function control page detects the nosing, it will automatically stop as well. This is the sensor to the door. If the sensor is working, it will stop. If the sensor is working, it will stop. So this is the buzzer alarm control. You have if you open it, it will alarm. If you turn off. It will not alarm. This is the entire ear part. If the ear is turned off, the entire ear part will stop. When the ear is turned off, it will stop. The entire ear part will not alarm. So this is the buzzer alarm control. Okay. 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 And the fabric will continue to next processing. This is the nose pin. This is the stop of nose bridge mechanism. When you turn on it, when you turn on it, there will not install the nose pin. It will also automatically go next process. And when you turn off, you will have need to install the nose pin and the ear loop as well. Hello.
Merhaba. Earl Loop Installation Showing. Kanka bir tane ince. So, now we are showing how to install the Earl Loop. Oh. Bu böyle daha güzel. Okay. Ben hemen şimdi tamam. So we have to press this to make sure it's locked. So this this is this side and this is that side. Okay.